What's going on YouTube? Midwest Reviews here, coming at you with another video. Uh, today's video is going to be about smoking weed while working out, okay? Um, it's going to include if you smoke before you work out and if you smoke after you work out. It's going to be telling you the positive and negative things of both of those scenarios. So first we're going to start with pre-working out. So if you don't even know what that means, like pre-working out, it means like so you're, it's before you go to the gym, it's before you go lift or do whatever workouts you're doing. Um, is smoking weed good or bad? That, if that's your question, then I'm about to tell you right now. So I've smoked before the gym a lot. I've smoked, or I haven't smoked before the gym a lot. And I know a lot of the differences between the two. So for starters, whenever you go to the gym high, I have noticed, I've trial and error, I've conducted enough exper uh, experiments at this point to know that I'm more focused. I feel more focused. I feel more uh, almost, um, sorry, my camera was lagging out there. I know you guys saw it, but um, I stay more focused. I don't want to go talk to people and I don't want to go get distracted. I want to do every single number that I was planning on doing. Um, I, I don't want to get sidetracked or anything like that. So I feel as if I'm way more focused whenever I go to the gym high. Um, not only am I more focused, but I feel that I have better cardio. Like cardio is just easier and it's, um, it kind of makes me like, it kind of just makes me like zone out a little bit when I'm doing cardio, which is a good thing because I don't like doing cardio. And then, um, I already said like it makes me a lot less social like I don't want people to know that I'm high I don't, I don't want people to catch on so like I don't really talk to people which is a huge advantage on time and how long you're at the gym for I just drink one of these every day before the gym chief this just a little dab pen and then um, some negative things when we talking about smoking before the gym uh, I think for sure I get fatigued faster. I think my body, my muscle fatigue is um, like almost my cardiovascular endurance when it comes to working out goes way down. I can't work out for as long. I can't work out as hard for as long. And that might vary on each person. That's just how it is for me. I feel like I get a crash and then once that crash happens, the workout pretty much is done. But during that like hour, to hour 10 minutes of just pure like focus and energy you get a damn good workout in um you need to make sure that if you are smoking before you lift to not zone out that's a huge thing do not zone out and do not smell like weed if you're gonna smoke bud maybe smoke outside or watch my last video T like do that shit do that shit in your car so you don't smell like dank you know like take the precautions so you don't smell like weed in your gym Unless it doesn't matter, you know, unless you have a gym in your house or you know like everybody at your gym or something, I don't know. But, um, so that's pretty much all the pre-workout stuff. Like, uh, I couldn't really think of anything else for like smoking before you work out, but I could not think of many things at all for the negative side of smoking after you work out. So if you go get a nice lift in, sober or high, whatever you do, whatever you chose to do, um, smoking out after the gym is a must. If you didn't get to smoke before you work out, make sure to smoke after every single day. There's so many reasons. Like, it makes you hungry, and being hungry is a great thing if you want to lift and you want to get bigger. Um, it makes you tired. Rest is another huge thing to making you bigger and making you stronger. And it just overall keeps you relaxed. It makes your, it makes your muscles relax a little bit, and it just, it makes... It almost just makes everything um, just easier in a way. It makes time go by faster. It makes uh, it makes like all your progression like you're not just sitting sitting there sober, um, doing nothing. You're sitting there stoned as fuck playing Rocket League, you know, or whatever the hell you do. So the only negatives I said for this was just make sure to keep yourself motivated. Don't skip the gym. Don't be like, fuck it, I'm not going today. Um, just, I don't know, don't, if you want to do something, actually do it. Don't actually, don't uh, tell yourself that you're going to go to the gym all the time or 
that you're gonna like get big soon you know you have to get big now if you want to get big you have to start now and I started two years ago and I'm nowhere near where I would love to be you know I, I want to rep out 315 on bench you know I want to rep out like 500 on deadlifts like it's all very possible things that are pretty close to me but I just got to keep working and I wish I would have started earlier. That's what I tell myself. I wish I would have started when I was a freshman or sophomore in high school. I'd be a beast right now. But I started my junior year. So I got a little bit of a late start on that. But none of that even matters. It's in the past. So I just want you guys to know, stay motivated and just do it, okay? Actually, um, don't talk about it anymore. Just fucking do it.